Hey everyone, this is Matt with Learn Everything About Design. And in today's video, we're gonna be unboxing this Metro X 3D scanner from RevoPoint. Now remember we are an affiliate channel, which means that they do send me the scanner to review and play around with, but we are not gonna be using it in this video. This is just gonna be an unboxing video. We're gonna take a look at it, see what it looks like, see what we get in the kit and so on. But remember, this is a Kickstarter campaign. So if you're interested in this scanner, now is the time to get in on it because it's roughly 35% off what would be a retail price. They haven't released the pricing just yet, but you can sign up for updates and get information about it when it's released. With all that said, let's go ahead and dive in and see what this thing looks like. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look inside this box and see what we got. Uh, the first thing I notice is the box itself is pretty heavy. And when we crack it open, we can see why. So inside there is a suitcase and this looks very much like the one we have with the PMK kit for the new Morocco Plus. So that's a good sign. This means that it's gonna be pretty safe inside here, easy to store. A lot of the other scanners that we get, there'll be a carrying case or there'll be some sort of case, but generally all the stuff doesn't fit in it. So. There's nothing else here with this box, so everything should be inside. All right, so the first thing that we notice here, scanner is obviously here, looks like a bunch of cables and a turntable. Now, the turntable is something we don't see on all scanners in this segment, and especially not a turntable this big. Let's go ahead and get this thing out. Oh, there's a power supply underneath it. And so this actually looks like a pretty decent table that has a, a play and a forward and back button on it and uh, just a power plug on the back. But this is one of the tilting turntables. So it looks like it goes 30 degrees each direction. There are a couple of quarter 20 spots here where we can screw something down to hold it in place. Uh, so it's a pretty nice unit. You don't see that often with some of these kits. Um, again, keep in mind this is a Kickstarter campaign, so some of the accessories may change. Keep an eye on what the final looks like when, you, uh, when you're getting information about that. All right, so looks like some cables. Don't need the bag. All right, so it looks like USB 3.0 to USB-C and a power port on it. There is a power cable international power adapters, uh, USB-C to A. So if you are using a laptop that doesn't have USB-A on it, you might need to use that adapter. And it looks like another power supply. This one's gonna be for the scanner. Of course, the sample busts that they send. And there's a little door under here. There's a tripod. Uh, so this one has like a carbon fiber inlay on it, which is kind of neat. There's a spot where it looks like a snap lock piece goes in. Keep in mind with accessories like this, especially with Kickstarter campaign scanners, that these accessories are likely to change, um, sometimes for the better, sometimes for the worse. So just uh, keep in mind, pay attention to what you see on the Kickstarter campaign in terms of what's included in the kit. The fact that it does have this nice turntable and tripod, I would expect these to stay, but um, I generally don't scan with a tripod, but they're nice to have if you need to hold the scanner or something like that. And let's see, up top, looks like we've got some marker dots. And this should be the calibration board, I bet. Yep, got a calibration board in here. So that's pretty nice that it tucks away inside the top of the case here. Put it in this pocket. And then a little safety strap. All right, and last but not least, the actual scanner. All right, 
And there we have it. It's actually quite a bit lighter than I thought it would be. Um, probably just because of the, the bulk of the case. But it seems like we've got a, a plastic case. We've got our depth cameras and it looks like they've got some illumination LEDs. I would imagine that this is an RGB camera for color scans. And then of course in the center is where we're gonna be projecting our laser pattern out. It looks like we've got our USB-C connector on the back side, and we've got a couple of buttons on the top. So we've got a play, start and stop your scan, plus a minus for setting your exposure value. And then there's an M button here. I'm not really sure what the M button does yet. My guess is it goes from maybe manual to auto exposure. So we'll just have to see what that does when we get in to play around with it. Um, but yeah, it looks like a pretty nice unit. It has a hand strap, so you don't drop the thing when using it, so that's kind of nice. And that's everything that's in the kit. So once again, remember, this is a Kickstarter campaign, which means that that Revopoint has a goal. And I've been informed that if they reach their goal, there's gonna be a bonus gift in all of these kits. I don't really know what it is at the time. It's, it's not here, obviously. This looks like all the standard stuff that you would expect. Um, so just keep in mind that they do have their stretch goal and if they hit it, they are gonna be tossing in something as a, a free gift. If you are looking to buy, I do urge you to get in at least to be notified on the Kickstarter campaign. And that's simply because that's gonna be the cheapest you'll probably ever get this scanner if you're at all interested in it. And we will be doing some follow-ups, which I'll talk about in just a second. But everything here looks pretty good. I'm gonna go ahead and just make sure I didn't miss anything. Nothing else in the pocket. And it looks like it has a pretty nice permanent foam insert in this little section here where the tripod can go underneath. All right, so there's our first look at the new Metro X laser 3D scanner from Revopoint. Now, keep in mind, just a couple more disclaimers. We are an affiliate channel, so consider it the paper motion, like I mentioned at the beginning. But with that affiliate, if you are signing up for the Kickstarter campaign, we don't get anything, which is perfectly fine. But keep in mind, that's the best time to buy. So if you're considering this at all, the Kickstarter campaign will be about 35% off the retail price of this scanner. So just make sure you keep that in mind that while I am giving you information about the scanner, there is no direct benefit to the channel for things like affiliate links. So hopefully that helps when you're making a decision. We will be doing future videos with this and we're gonna get them out as quickly as we can. We'll do a review of using the scanner and then we'll also do some content on how to use it. So just like we have with our Revelpoint Morocco and the Morocco Plus, we are gonna be releasing that content as soon as we can. There's gonna be a video on the IR optical zoom for the Morocco Plus coming out later this week. We also have a video in the works for the PMK and global marker alignment. So trying to get all that information out to you. And this thing just happened to hit at the same time. So we'll get to this as quickly as possible. We'll do that review video first, make sure that we understand how this thing works in practice and make sure you understand it too. But if there are any other questions or comments, please leave them. Consider subscribing and letting us know what you wanna see with this and other scanners. We'll do our best to make sure that we get to that. But as always, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.